Good morning, Big Spring High School. I'm sitting in a classroom this morning. It's a little bit after 8 o'clock, just thinking about you. I'll tell you here in just a second why I chose this particular classroom because of one sign that was on the board that is just very, very meaningful to me, and I know it's going to be meaningful to you here in just a moment when I share uh, the, the, how that caught my attention. Anyway, uh, I have my fashion design, my quarantine design hoodie on. Uh, today, our student council uh, this whole week has put out some, some theme days like they're so good to do to uplift our spirits here at Big Spring High School. Yesterday was I Miss Our Sports theme. I had the softball, baseball shirt that I have on. As we were handing out work, we had a lot of fun. I had my baseball cap on and just uh, thinking about the sports that we're missing out on. Uh, today, I have my quarantine shirt, my hoodie on that I wear outside of school all the time because I love this hoodie for more than one reason. But uh, the reason I'm sitting in this room this morning is I want to share something with you uh, that just uh, come across my mind. Back in 1665, there was a guy by the name of Isaac Newton that was in quarantine similar to what we're doing today. They were having to practice social distancing and he was in quarantine. And believe it or not, he did some of his most famous work in this time of quarantine. He uh, used his time wisely, like we have challenged you to use your time wisely to make sure that you're there getting your work done, uh, communicating with your teachers. I hope our teachers are communicating back uh, to you. We're going to be talking to our teachers today about making sure that we are great communicators so that we can support you through this, this time of learning while we're quarantined. Anyway, Isaac Newton, in his early 20s one day, as he was quarantined, was sitting underneath a tree and just thinking and uh, an apple bopped him on the head, falling out of the tree and, and hit him right smack in the middle of his head. And he got to thinking about that. And lo and behold, he started writing as he was thinking. He, he, he wrote some of his most famous work during this time of quarantine. He uh, wrote, a, um, a, a, authored a book called Mathematica. He, he wrote about the three laws of motion, which included gravity. Uh, speaking of the apple bopping him on the head, falling out of that tree, but he did a lot of his great work. And I challenge you to do the same thing during this time of quarantine. Be great thinkers. Do something wisely with your time. Use your mind. Think. And, and who knows, maybe in the future we'll be talking about some great things that, that you discovered or that you wrote about. Who knows? We, we believe around here at Big Spring High School that our uh, high school students uh, we always say this, they, they never cease to amaze us, and, and we know that you know, you'll do the same in this time of quarantine when you are out there using your time wisely. But I'm going to get up now, and I'm going to show you what caught my attention with this note on uh, this board. You can see as I'm coming in closer, whoa, wait a minute, there's some calculus right there. Uh, guess what? Isaac Newton authored calculus. But there's the sign, do not erase. How about that? Guess what? Students, we're at Big Spring High School, we're in classrooms, we still have the work up on our boards, and we're not erasing. As we have said many times here, as we have chanted, we believe. Have a great day.